and welcome to another episode of Kentucky Bird Review. I'm Steel Reserve. Special K. And I'm Radar. Tonight we're going to be doing Omegon, Game of Thrones, uh, Iron Throne, Throne Blonde, Blonde Ale. And it's 6.5% alcohol by volume. We've been waiting for all three of us to get together to drink it. Or all four of us. Fuzzy is off camera here. Say hi off camera, Fuzzy. Hi off camera, Fuzzy. That's kind of uh, old. It could pop out. It's not that saying. old. I don't think it's like a champagne cork, it's just kind of... Nah, it's happened before. Uh, I got some Avery's uh, one time, and I took the cage off, and it shot up. Like, it bounced all over the living room. Radar gets bottom beer. I'm okay with that. Oh, got, got it, got it, got it. It's like yeah. Color. All right, so uh, the color, it's got nice bubble shrooms in it. It's Look got a... Nice cloudy honey appearance. Look at it though. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like jello. That's a beefy head. <laughs> that is a beefy head. Yeah. Holy crap. <laughs> it says I'm not gonna spill. That's all I have to say. It's like jello. Alright, alright, anyways, yes. So as they say it's a beefy head. Uh it's nice little hoppiness. Uh so maybe some dark fruits in there. Uh it's got a very rich head on it. It is absolutely that impossible to see through. Easily float a bottle cap on that. Like, you, you know, you this can't uh, see through that. It's not possible. This is suitable if you serve to kings or pretenders of the honor throne. Ho ho ho! Heck yeah! Yeah. Pour slowly so as to not disturb the yeast sediment. Well, I'm not gonna promise that happened. I mean, All right, I'm tired I, of talking. Screw you guys. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's very, very weedy. Like, have you had your Wheaties? Because if you haven't had your Wheaties, you can have one of these and not worry about eating Wheaties for a month. Quite delicious. Because this will make you strong. And this is a Belgian style here, so um, get a little bit of the, like that cinnamony kind of flavor in the back end. It's got a little citrus notes in there. Um, and it's got a very nice multi characteristic and very light hoppy presence up front. It tastes kind of delicious. I, I, I don't, I don't now know. Now this is a 10 to $15 bottle of beer, of course. But unless you go to Jungle Gems and then you can get it for eight bucks. Uh, you know, it's a little over, uh, when see. it came out. I don't know how much it costs now. It's a little over it 26 out. ounces, 25, 26 ounces. So typical size. There's yeah. kind of a, Walmart. there's kind of a, do you guys have like a raisiny type thing going yeah, on? Yeah, dark there? fruits. A little bit. Like, it kind of has a raisiny thing for me. I think it's delicious. I um, doubt that it's got raisins in it. But I'm trying to right. impress my buddies. I'll bring one of these out. I mean, oh, yeah. it's, it's good and it's neutral. It's very neutral in flavor, so it wouldn't offend anybody. There's no real strong. It leaves such a pleasant aftertaste. It does. Oh, this is not drinkable though at <laughs> all. I don't, like, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know that you could drink. Maybe, a maybe you are a pretender. It's not meant to be a to the beer. Iron Throne. Maybe I am. Yeah, yeah it's excellent. Um, maybe, beautiful maybe head. Head still sticking around. Really nice head. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a eight. Uh, it doesn't get an eight point five because of the price, but I'm gonna give it an eight. Expensive, yeah. Um, it's very good. It's a party beer. It's great to bring, share with three friends. It's perfect. Um, each of you could get like a nine, ten ounce glass. Um, would I recommend it? Uh, absolutely. I love Omegon beers. They do some really I solid mean, beers. I, uh, I have an Omegon glass at home. Do you? Take it. It's also a Game of Thrones glass. But it's Omegon. I got it off the HBO store. Aha. How about you, Radar? Oh, it's expensive. Um, all of the Omegon series, Omegang series that has come out that has been HBO themed. Have been delicious. Very delicious. Uh -oh. Very good, but very expensive. Like, even for Omegon beers, they're, they're very expensive. Um, I don't know. For that extra price, I think I'm going to give it like a seven and a half. It's really good. It's very good, but for like, when they first came out, they were $15. 
And they've only been going up from there. Like, if you look back at uh, 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 Dragon's Blood, is that what the first one was called? It's the first one we had. It's a, yeah, that's, that's right. That's the first one it's we had. Red Ale. Oh, that's like, it's like eighty dollars a bottle now. Like, if you live in a state where it can be shipped to legally, that's because there was a limited run. That was the only yeah. run they did. Well, that's year. the same way with these. Yeah. They just get more and more expensive. And well, it's, it's like just, a line. That's, that's that's why I have one of these just chilling in my apartment. That's clever. So that was a good idea. Um, well, hell, like I said, so they were, expensive. They were relatively cheap at gym, Jungle Gems. I probably would have got a couple of them if I went with you. But uh, they're, they're so expensive. And, and for that reason, that's why it gets the score. It gets. I'm, I'm going to actually give this an 8.5. Like, I'm enjoying just sipping it, you know. This isn't one of those. I'm just gonna chug this club of blood party, party, party. No, this is your more sophisticated gatherings. You think sophisticated sea would like this? Uh, it's probably not expensive enough. For them. Oh, that's right. It's only like what about it's what about like thirty dollars? This would be like this would be like a party beer he would drink at a party, like never did like a, like a like a college party. If you ever went to a college party, this would be his cheap beer pong beer, probably. I think Sona read the first book, uh, but after that he stopped. Uh, and now he's reading something by uh, by Heinlein. I don't, I don't see know what he's has reading to do now. With beer. We recommend him. We recommend him. Uh, of course I do. I do. I I, I do. You definitely can find one. I recommend this. the Game of Thrones beer. They're worth a try. They are. All right. Well, that's our episode. Hope There's gang, something you'd like to see on our channel. You can leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay. Still reserved. And I'm Radar. Thanks, Thanks for watching. watching.